osteoporosis can be a physically debilitating disease, but oftentimes a few home modifications can make a world of difference for people living with MS. As Alan Janae shows us, one simple renovation has changed one woman's life. John Stevens has become a busy legislative advocate for the National MS Society. I talked to the different state senators and then the state representatives to make sure that everybody knew what MS was. First met Don last year when the legislature was considering a home modification bill. Our Sean Boyd helped Don get down her front steps, a task she could not maneuver by herself because of multiple sclerosis. I can't go downstairs at all without using a rail. And you know, like, or at least having some sort of support or something. After Sean's story, a company volunteered to make the modifications Dawn needed. There was two guys that came over and installed uh, two handrails, one outside and one in my garage, and free of charge, it was really cool. Now that Dawn can get out of her home on her own, she has not stopped fighting for people living with MS. It made me feel really good because, like, I can speak up for other people that may not be able to speak up for themselves. She went to Washington, D.C. and lobbied congressional staffers. She was on the front lines as Colorado lawmakers again took up the home modification bill this session. She was even by the governor's side as he signed the bill into law. That was amazing. One small improvement led to a whole new life for Dawn Stevens. Now she's once again making a meaningful contribution to her community. Alan Janae covering Colorado First. Way to go, Dawn. We appreciate you. And you can also support the efforts of the National MS Society by taking part in Bike MS. We've got information about how to register for that ride or how you can donate on our website, cbsdenver.com.